Hey everybody, it's April and uh, time for our Friday plank break. And you know, I like to do some different things. So today we're gonna play around mostly on our forearms. I may go to my hands after I get really tired on my forearms because I think forearms are harder. Um, but we'll see how it goes. And, but I like to throw in some different things just so you can see that you're not limited on your planking and what you're gonna do. Also, I'm in my little dress, so we'll see how that goes as well. Um, hopefully we don't have an unexpected peep show. All right, so I'm gonna set things up on my forearms. And you know, it's a good idea just to reach around your arms just so you know you have the right distance um, between your elbows. And then you can interlace your fingers out in front of you if you like. Pull your shoulder blades together and then reach them down your back. Lift your upper back, lift your chest, pull in your belly, come up on your toes, shift your weight forward slightly, and then do that again. Whoop, I need to start the timer. Pressing into the floor, lifting your upper back, pulling in your belly, really working on that core strength, tightening up your glutes, pressing your heels back. So I was thinking maybe we would hold it here for about a minute and then I will add on, we'll add on some other things with our um, forearms. <clears throat> one of them in particular is going from forearms to hands. I think we'll do that one first because I find that one to be very difficult. And every time, 30 seconds, I see somebody do it on Instagram or YouTube or whatever, they make it look so easy. They just go right from their forearms to their hands. I find it very difficult. So we're gonna try a few in a minute just to see how it goes. You may find it to be very easy. Or maybe you have a tip you can throw to me about how to get into the, go to your hands a little bit easier. So we're coming up here, we got about five more seconds. Tighten everything up again. Okay, we're at one minute. So bring your hands out in front of you. And then we're going to just lift up. I say just, but it's not. Lift up onto your hands. So lift up and then come back down. Lift up <laughs> and come back down. See, I think this is kind of hard. Really, really though, if you think about using your abdominal muscles, tightening up your glutes, <laughs> lift up. Notice I did that one arm at a time that time and come back down. And let's do it a couple more times. Lift up, come back down. And I can't do it with both arms at the same time. I'm gonna do it again. Lift up uh, and come back down. One more time. Lift up, <laughs> that was totally cheating. And come back down. Now I gotta do it again just because that one was so bad. And pull in your belly, lift with your glutes eh, up to your hands and come back down. Okay, so we're gonna do um, dips. So coming onto your forearm, come into a side plank, bring your hand to your hip, and then just dip your hip down and up, down and up. Keep going, dipping and lifting. So that lifting is really where you're getting the activation in your obliques. Down, up, down, up, down, up. I'm gonna switch sides. So pulling my dress down a little bit, come back to your side plank on the other side, hand to your hip, down, up, down, up. Keep going, up, down, and up. And again, really remember, lift your hip up, working your obliques, working that side body, trimming your waist. And we're almost to three minutes. So I'm going to switch back to both forearms. Whoop, here goes my dress again. <laughs> this wasn't a good idea, was it? Okay, so we're gonna do another one on side plank, coming on to your forearm. Reach your arm up and then reach it down and through. And up and through. Up and through. I gotta pull my dress down. Up and through. Keep going. We're gonna do this for about a minute, half a minute. Up and through. And now we're gonna switch sides. Forearm and lift your hips up, through. That one wasn't a good one. Up and through, up, through, up, through. Keep going. So this really works on your abs here. You should feel this. Keep going. And we're at four minutes, so I'm gonna stop. 
pull my dress down again. <laughs> and I'm going to finish off just on my forearms. <laughs> pull in your belly again. Press into the floor. You've got this. I've got it. I'm sweating a little bit, though. You know, when you add activity to your plank, it really increases. It makes it more cardiovascular. Get your heart rate up. Makes you a little sweatier. So I am perspiring. 430. Check back in. Separate your shoulders. Pull in your belly. Tighten up your glutes. Press your heels back. You've got this. We're going for it. We've got 20 more seconds. You can do it. And I am quitting at five minutes today. Usually I hold it a few seconds longer. I don't see that happening. 10 more seconds. You can do anything for 10 seconds. Pull in your belly. Press into the floor. Tighten up your glutes. And whew, we're at five minutes. Wow, we. Okay. I don't know about you, but I thought that was a good one. <laughs> Have a good day. Have a good weekend. See ya.